Are you having trouble calibrating your unique controller? Watch this video. Hello, Tim LaGuardia, Assistant Service Manager here at New Tech Machinery. Today, we're gonna to be talking about how to reset the parameters in your unique controller to help you with your calibration. Do you think there's a possibility you over-calibrated your machine? What I mean by that is if you try to manually calibrate your machine too many times, you're gonna actually change the parameters in the computer. I'm gonna teach you today how to put those parameters back to factory settings so that the computer can calibrate on its own. Let's go over to the unique controller and I'm gonna show you how to do that. With your unique controller powered up, you'll want to make sure that the switch is in the auto position. Once the motor is running and your switch is in auto, down in the lower left-hand corner, you can push machine setup. Once in the machine setup, if you go over to machine calibration and hit that button, you'll see the blue start lighting up. Once that's lit up, go ahead and hit calibrate. For this, you'll have to hit the tape measure. And in this screen right here, down in the lower right-hand corner, you'll see a button that says reset to defaults. You'll wanna hit that button. And what that's gonna do is that's gonna bring up a warning basically saying from where you're set right now, you're gonna set everything back to the default settings, which is where the original program is. So we want to confirm that. Once that's confirmed, these numbers down here, stopping distance and the circumference of your encoder will go back to factory settings. Then you can exit the screen. The next process is from here, you will go into job entry. And I'm gonna go ahead and delete all the parts that are in there out because what we're gonna go ahead and do is add a part and we're gonna program it for, we'll say five pieces at 16 inches long. Once you've done that, you'll go ahead and want to run these five pieces because now what we're doing is we're letting the computer find itself. Once you run those five pieces, go ahead and measure them. If they're still not quite right, run five more again because we're trying to get the computer to start self-calibrating. Once you see it start dialing in, then you can start trying to run your longer pieces and then you should be back to where you should be. To reset the machine length calibration, you will need to go in and enable notching Tell it, yes, you do have it in there. Then you will go into machine calibration, wait for the blue line to illuminate. Once that's done, you hit calibrate, and then in the lower right-hand corner, hit machine length calibration. Once in there, then you can hit reset to default settings. It'll tell you where it's going, and then you confirm it. Now you can run your five pieces at approximately 16 inches to help start calibrating your machine. If you have any further questions about our unique controller or just want to learn more about your machine, go to our website, newtechmachinery.com, and visit our learning center. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.